Hello YouTube, it is NickC3838 here, and in this video I have some gameplay of the new Marvel 3 multiplayer map Parish, and we're playing Kill Confirmed, and here's the video gameplay that is the third video out of the three new maps that came out for September, and this is one of the new maps that are going to be the last DLC maps for Marvel 3, and this is a pretty interesting map, it's, it's kind of different, it's kind of close quarters and it's got like a church is the main building over here and there's a lot of firefights going on right in there and uh, some hallways and passageways little alleyways that's mainly what this map is it's pretty small I don't think it's that small but it just seems small to me I'm not sure if it's medium or small technically but it seems small to me uh, so here we go with the gameplay, and I'm not doing too great. Let's see how many kills. I got one kill, three deaths. It's getting pretty fast paced. There's some snipers and a lot of grenades being thrown. Uh, sometimes I like to keep quiet when I'm playing because it helps me focus on the gameplay, and uh, that'll usually help me out. So if I get too quiet sometimes, I'm sorry about that. Looking to the right, but there are, there are about two of them to the left. Ooh, nice double. Getting more dog tags. And I got my UAV. There was a lot of them spawning in right there. And right there, my extended mags and suppressor came in handy. I'm not a big fan of using the ACR because I know it's like everyone's favorite gun to use and I really don't like people using it. But I'm not very great at Xbox. I'm more of a PS3 player if you don't know. Uh, and so I'm just using the ACR just to try to get some good gameplay. Not too bad gameplay. And uh, the extended mags attachment has definitely helped me out because I'm not very accurate with the Xbox controller. And uh, in a situation like th that just happened to a couple, like uh, I think it was a minute ago, uh, that definitely came in handy. This map seems very fast paced. There's uh, you gotta watch your back. That's where a lot of enemies are coming from. It doesn't look like there's a lot of different ways you can go. There's like three main alleyways and then two sideways and then some buildings you can go through. That seems like how the map layout is. I'm not 100% sure, but that's what it seems like to me. And that sniper was laying on the ground. He was feeling pretty good like that. Get these dog tags. That's what's most important is getting your teammates, helping out your team. And that's some pretty nice teamwork, I think, right there. We all just went right through that hallway full of enemies. We just keep calling those dog, getting those dog tags. And there is the whole team right there. If I threw a grenade, that would have been pretty awesome, but uh, I didn't think about throwing grenades. I thought if I had the extended mags, that would come in handy, but obviously that didn't work out. Oh, it looked like he had a tactical knife on his pistol, and that's what got me. That's another thing I do not like about Call of Duty, when their EMPs are getting called in, especially in Marfa 3. When an EMP is getting called in, it's usually when I'm in a tight situation with a competitive fight with another enemy. Or having a really big firefight. That uh, EMP seems to last a little too long, where the white screen just completely gets you distracted and you can't see a thing. Even on your own team, I think the enemy team should be the only team that sees that white blank screen because it's messing up your own teammates, even if it's a friendly uh, EMP. So that's getting pretty annoying, but that's gotten me killed plenty of times. But um, I really would like if they didn't have that on your own team. That would make a lot more sense if you ask me. This sniper seems to be running around with just a pistol as a secondary with a tack knife. And I think there's two of them. They're all on this side of the map, it appears. <clears throat> UAV 
And that was a pretty quick game. I think it's because my teammates did pretty good. We were all collecting dog tags, and uh, we worked pretty good with some teamwork, even though I don't think any of us had mics on. We still did pretty good teamwork, and I think that's why we won. I didn't do too bad, but I still went what I call negative. I had less kills than I had deaths, so uh, 12 and 18, not too bad. But that's it for the uh, Parish gameplay, and that's pretty much it. So comment, rate, subscribe, and thanks for watching.